Farming Simulator 2011. 2049. Uh, In the year 2049, farming has become a wasteland. Far farming Simulator. Yeah. Uh, Farmville. Uh, Sil Silicon Valley. What's the name? Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley, yeah. Cops. These cops are the coming to snatch your crops. These are the ga gaming's hall hall of farm hallmark. These, these are the pinnacle of farming and video games. And Jason, yes, I'm here to posit: What if those games uh -huh. where you farm crops, boring ass shit? What if you instead had you guns? Boring. More guns than you can farm. Well, like two or three guns. Two or three guns. Yeah, sign me up. This, uh, this is colorful as hell. Farming, but what if guns? That is, and also in the post-apocalypse, that is what we're dealing here with. Atomic crops. Mm -hmm. This is a game out in early access right now in the Epic Store. Okay. Uh, and it's kind of a half, it's a run-based game that's kind of somewhere between a Stardew Valley, not really, and a nuclear throne, more like that. Okay. So, right out the gate, this game... I'm getting kind of like a Moonlighter kind of vibe, like you, yeah. like during the day you do one thing, at night you do another thing. Yes. Okay. That is pretty spot on. So right now, uh, you can see I have a, a, a timer up there in the yep. corner. That's gonna be sunset. When sunset comes, you have to defend your crops, Sun you know? down, you better get your crops. Better get your crops. Crops run it. That. <clears throat> what are you doing? And I'm watering. Oh, sure. Uh, I'm watering these crops. What yeah. happens when that timer hits zero, though, Jason? It's... Is stuff hits the fertilizer, hits the fan. Oh, boy. Um, oh, I forgot my starter. Potatoes. Um, so, are right now. Are those good to start with? Potatoes? Uh, they are kind of your, your go to. Okay. Um, Starting a fresh run. This is a brand new run. Defend right your crops. Here. I'm defending my crops. This is a brand new run. Okay. Um, and so we're starting from square one here. What this game is 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 the, the progression loop is as follows: plant crops. Mm -hmm. With those crops, you go back to town and sell them for money. Uh, and then with that money, you can buy gear that helps you explore new areas in the world. Yeah, that's which that's get what's you new crops. Farming. Yeah, which sell for more money. And it kind of kind of goes as this. So when you start a new run, you kind of always have like what I like to call a farming phase. I feel like this game <laughs> goes back and forth between farming and exploration pretty my, well. My dad went through a farming phase, <laughs> no, and, and we moved out to a farm. Oh really? Yeah, and uh, I don't I don't remember what the hell he tried to farm, but he had nothing. He had no idea on how to farm. Did he? It didn't last long. Bring his assault rifle. No, he did not. Well, but he bought a tractor. Uh, tractor's very important for farming. We'll maybe show those off a little bit. You see how my plants are all hopping around? Yeah, they're- That means they're ready for harvest. Oh, they're having a great time. And now they're dead. Well, they're not dead. Mm, I guess they're- Yeah, you killed them. They're technically them. dead. Oh, I gotta water you. Uh, so the watering's automatic. You, uh, go to the well here, you see- Oh, okay. Um, so you got like a meter, like a water meter. wave, or down there, kind of, is how many waters you have. Okay. And then if they need water, you just simply have to stand next to them. Okay, that's a little bit easier than what I was thinking. Yeah. Because um, there seems to be an awful lot going. There like like is. in my head, like I'm worried about the crop prices, you know? Like oh. how much the, those potatoes are gonna sell for. But then you also gotta worry about these little dudes that are coming to snatch your crops. Yeah, fortunately, and then you gotta shoot them. it's a little less intense than that. Okay. So uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and get my land ready. You see, it's almost morning. When morning comes, we're gonna be whisked away. Back to our hub. Oh god, that was really bright. Hey, that just happened. I want to go home. Hey, dude. This is how I would get to school on the farm. I like that it's just an inner tube. Our driveway was like a quarter mile long. <laughs> Jeez, it was ridiculous. Um, so you have the price breakdown here, and now you're kind of in this hub world. So you can do a lot of things here. You can buy seeds. Mm -hmm. Uh, which is a good way to start out. I've already got some seeds here. Uh, you can buy weapons. Ooh, cool. Shotgun, I like rifle. the assault rifle quite a bit, so I'm gonna right. get But that so far guy. you've only seen, like, a handful of different weapons. Yeah, Two or I three. guess I bought the shotgun. All right, oops. Okay, oops, it's fine. What's this guy's deal? He's waiting to be harvested. That's pumpkin head. 
I gotta say, uh, this game initially I did not like the look of, just based on the first character oh, here really? and the one you talked to, but like meeting more of these guys, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm into it. And like the music, it's really goofy. Yep. Uh, so some other things you can do in the hub world, you can heal. There's always one heart up for grabs. They cost roses. Roses are like any other crop, except they kind of go into their own inventory. Mm -hmm. You can also use roses to romance somebody. Thank uh, God there's love interests in here. We okay. got Borage. Ooh. Um, hey, what's up? Borage is kind of your... So you basically have two options here. You have Barrage and mm -hmm. Rue. Uh, Barrage is like kind barrage. of more farming-centric. Good. Uh, their upgrades kind of have to do with, like, uh, efficiency. Um... Okay. And then uh, Ruse is more about like the world, exploring and, and surviving the world. I really like this. This is an early access if you couldn't tell this part <laughs> that this upgrade just literally spells out one move speed. That looks B. great. Uh, let's go with Marge. Yeah. Bro. Hello. I'm feeling it. So we've got this scythe now. Oh, they That'll gave you a scythe. Rotate. You traded. Okay, for a scythe, okay. Um, and you see the, the flirt has gone up to four. I think there's marriage straight flirt. up in this game. Okay, good. Uh, so if you romance somebody enough, I don't know if like romancing one and then the other will cause maybe a little hate. A little rift. Uh, so we don't have a ton of crops this time. Maybe we, you're Mormon, whatever. Yeah, that's true. I, maybe I you don't, have more than one. In a, in a th thruple, those are hot right now. Um, so we don't have a ton of crops, so I'm just gonna drop these guys off real quick. Um, you planting taters? I'm planting taters in a date. And then now let's go, uh, let's pop over and explore. So immediately to the uh, east mm -hmm. and west, uh, they're open up. The south and north require an upgrade uh, to get. Okay. Or they require bridge materials. Ooh, I like call this, them. this spread gun. This is pretty good. Yeah. Bad range, but yeah. uh, really, really good if you can get in there. So, uh, what kind of resources are you getting out here? So you can find a lot of different things. So you find these little random camps that clear out once you, oh God. Oh shit. Yeah, those guys are just fuckers. Uh, so I can, these are just straight up choose an item. Nearby crops grow twice as fast. Uh -huh. Tilling that soil grows. has a chance to drop fertilizer and a seed. I'm gonna go with the growth aura, that seems good. Um, these birds will offer me a scroll. Scroll are like one-time use items. Okay. Um, lesser blood rain. All crops gain two fertilizer. Okay. That seems good. Or rain cloud. Let's go hmm. fertilizer. Okay. Um, sometimes you find animals, like farm animals, uh, that are being held captive. Ooh. I really like the, the bullet hell uh, aspect of this game. You get some really cool enemy bullet patterns later nice. on. Um, so the farm animals, yeah, do they give it'll you resources be like, as well, or do they just help you, like, you've got an oxen and it helps you pull the plow. Exactly. Okay. Like, the, here we go. Uh, so we got a chicken and a cow. Uh, the chicken will uh, pull up weeds. Oh, and nice. the cow, I think, Andy. waters. Okay. Yeah. Let's get the cow. Yeah, I got um, the cow. And then you find these sometimes. These will bring you to a golden chest, which usually has a mini boss, which uh, we're not, unfortunately, going to have time to defeat because you can see it's almost morning time. We got this turret. Uh, I don't know what happens if time runs up when you're over here. I uh, and I'm Should we find inclined out? to find out. Let's, Let's do see. It. Oh jeez, just got all hazy. You got to go back. Okay. You got to go back with the cow. Yeah, I'm just gonna go back because they're gonna eat my crops otherwise. Could you put like armor or maybe another gun on the cow? I could put a gun on the ground. I got that oh, turret. Okay. Um. So other things to note, uh, see how I have two pickaxes pick there yeah. in the bottom left? So you use up pickaxes like you would in any sort of crafting game by using them a lot, which means you're not going to right out the gate have a lot of land because you have okay. to till the land before you plant the seeds, you know? So I can't just plant don't a I seed know. here. Right. Jason, yeah, I don't know. I don't have to say, do you know? You're a farm man. Yeah, we you didn't just have- just revealed that you're a farmer. We didn't have running water. We had an outhouse. You had to have a cow walk around with a, a bucket to pour. No, we had a bucket upstairs that we used to do our business in. Oh boy. And we'd cover it with a Disno duck, our disco duck on uh, LP. <laughs> what? Uh, Didn't you? Uh, no, we used um, uh, Spock's album. Oh, okay. Nice. With the Hobbit song? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, nice. Bilbo Baggins. Yep. Um, so. Bilbo. 
we're progressing through the seasons. Uh, there's kind of three days, if you want to call it, three events per season. You see that's a two out of three there. Uh, and then at the end, the mayor rewards you based on that, uh, how you've done. And then the enemies also kind of upgrade. So we'll, we'll probably get to summer here. Health <laughs> is definitely the most precious resource. Uh, it is the thing that is hardest to come by in the world. Mm -hmm. It costs a rose, which, as you can see, I'm not oh, going to have any roses we here. We need those to flirt with. Yeah, exactly. And you want to be spending those on flirting. I hate these guys. They're the guys launching long range. Uh, the bigger plants like this guy yeah. take a lot of resourcing, but they tend to spit out uh, rather than just like a one-time haul. They'll just chill there forever and okay. slowly spit out um, plants. Okay. Uh, you can also do, if you do a 4x4 four four grid, you'll grow a mega vegetable. So like I could do a mega potato. Mega potato. Which is worth like five times rather than... Not just four. Four. Uh, guns only last a day. Okay. So you see my assault rifle there broke. I can get a new one uh, if I'd like. But this one seems like I'm going to be pretty uh, focused on the actual farming. Uh, these are the bridge upgrades that you need to get to another area. I previously okay. mentioned. Um, yeah, let's just, uh, I'm just gonna get back into this. Okay. All right, so last day of spring. Let's go get that golden chest. Not the mini boss? Uh, yeah, that's where the mini boss oh, will be. Gotcha. And then since this is the third day, we'll also have to fight a boss boss. Okay. And those appear to be static. Like, I've fought the same guy every spring, same guy every summer. I've only ever gotten as far as summer. Oh, that's um, interesting. And then at the end, it, like, once you die, it kind of grades you on how much money you earned, and that's your score. Right. How much uh, do you carry over? Almost nothing. Okay. Uh, I got a trailer now, motherfucker. Let's uh, go. Oh, Let's here go. we go. Here we go. Uh, so the trailer, the trailer is kind of like your ultimate. Uh, you see that it has a meter there in the bottom right. Yeah. Uh, that builds as you, I believe, kill enemies and harvest crops. All right. Me too. My meter builds when I harvest crops. Mine builds when I eat uh, cheeseburgers. Nice. All right, and then you get the, from these golden chests, you kind of get a permanent item. So I got this heart, which regens once a day, basically. It's like a little bonus heart. Ooh, how much was it to fix the bridge? Uh, those uh, back in the hub area, that little, those little bundles of lumber. Okay. Uh, you can buy those for a hundred dollars each, so Holy they're pretty shit. pricey. Um, but presumably there are better items down there, better seeds, more bosses, more bosses, more bull crap. Um, oh yeah, look who's ready to harvest. Yeah, that guy, super potato. So I gotta clear these weeds. Get him out of here. I'm gonna plant these seeds. Cow, you can help. Thank you. Yeah, please. We'll pull your weight over here, and we know it's a lot. Cows are heavy. Hefty heifer. Do you have any farm animals? No, we had a chicken, I think. But okay. I don't think it lasted long. Uh, we had a chicken hawk. Uh, we also had some bats. A chicken hawk is like supposed to scare off. Well, no, we didn't. It wasn't like ours. It was just like out there in the wilderness and it made horrific screeching sounds in the middle of the night. I do that too. Yeah. Oh, look, let's, look at this. Look at this bullshit. You see this thing? What the hell is you that? You see this thing? Yeah. Here we go. What? It's the boss. Oh no. I like the music. Yeah. This is farming music. Yeah, you know, this game has been winning me over the more I've played it. Uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely got its own charm. Yes. Oh, sure. Track oh, ready. Shit. Okay, let's let's find the boss. Wherever he may be. Where is he? But the, the thing that's a bummer here, too, is you still oh, have to is. prepare your crops. Go! Get him! I didn't oh, realize I was supposed to aim yeah, it. Aim it. Oh, no! Uh, so I'm still supposed to defend my crops amongst all this bull. Jeez. Um, and you see the timer's still going down, waves of enemies are still spawning. Yep. Cow's still kind of doing something. As there you we do. go. Monster pod. Good faces in this game. That's, what, that's something that I look for when Clean playing a game. Cleaning good faces. Cleaning good faces. Uh, 
ba 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 I think the vibe that this game reminds me of is like a, it's like a kids movie. You know, it's like okay, like goofy, over exaggerated bunnies shooting really big. Like none of the guns are super realistic. It's all to a little more, more land. Okay. Because this is the stuff that carries over between oh. buttons, right? Low on the pickaxes. Yeah. Pickaxes are expensive. They're maybe like the hardest to come by resource other than like health, which you start with. What about roses? Roses are tricky. I want to get back to the loving. I know. Uh, there's also fertilizer down mm -hmm. there. You see, I have 26 of those. Okay. Sprinkle that on a fresh crop. It'll. It, it didn't really say exactly what it does. I think it Sprinkle means it'll it on grow your faster. Okay, that's. That checks out. Oh no. Oh, okay. That's very concerned for a second. I was, but it was just the helicopter. Yay. Okay. Progress report. And they're like, wait, where'd the music go? Where did the music go? Where did the music go? You guys are go? just an acquaintance. I really want to... Whoa. Yeah! All right, so the town is satisfied, which means I'm going to get some items here. Okay. And here's where the music went. Oh! Lalo, lalo, leo. So I got a spell. Okay. I got another thorn. That's dope. Oh, hey, and some bridge materials. Cool. Uh, Where did they get all those balloons? Yeah, it's a lot of balloons. A lot of confetti. This is an expensive party. I hope they're not using my crops to fund I this. I think they are. Uh, okay. And this little area only kind of opens up at the end of a season. You've got some special items you can buy mm -hmm. for roses. You can buy a tractor. I mean, you should get the roses. Well, I only have one rose. Mm -hmm. And then there's this, Ooh. which I've never had a thousand potatoes. Nobody ever has. But I just, oh, I just love how scummy. Like, look at that. Look at that course. tie. Yeah. Let's go. Let's hop into summer. Okay. Welcome to summer. Uh, I was trying to to look up the kind of chronology of this game, and it seems that this might be the first uh, game from this developer. Okay. And I think it's a. Uh, I think it's pretty cool. You mentioned that this is early access. Is there any kind of roadmap or anything? That... Yeah, so they just put out their first uh, roadmap plan, Bullet whatever point. you want to call it. Yeah, yeah. Um, and they're going to be adding some new, another playable character, okay. which will presumably have something different about them. Uh, there, what else are they adding? Uh, new boss behavior. Somebody new else enemies. other than Rue to romance. Yes, more romance options. Okay, good. Okay, how I'm do in. I actually fix the bridge? There we go. So now we have access to this new area. Um, oh, wow. New stuff. New music. New enemies. Oh, she. New bull crap. That's back at your farm. I'm, try I, I, I'm trying to cuss less, and for me, for some reason, that how's means that, saying that crap out? instead of shit. Okay. Don't think it's actually doing anything. I mean, it's kind of the same word. Just it's almost exactly the same word. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's save this poor flamingo. It's crying. What do you think the flamingo does? I don't know. I've never seen a flamingo. Prances about. Okay. Okay. He just gave me some shit. He literally just gave me some fertilizer. Gave you a little shit. <laughs> Give me some seeds too. Oh, I like the chili plant a lot. The chili plant's got good personality. You know what this game actually made me really want? Another uh, zombies. Yep. Yeah. Versus plants. Yep. Yes. Or no, actually, I had zombies. Uh, Super Nintendo neighbors? game. Yeah. Zombies yeah. My neighbors. Sure. That also has similar vibes to yeah. this. Okay. Oh, this is getting a little bullet hell. I just want to make it through another night. Give him fertilizer. Uh oh. Oh no, I want to finish this area. 
kill a stupid rabbit. Ah! I don't need another turret. I'm Save gonna be. <laughs> I'm coming. I have no plans to defend, but I'm coming. All right, let's plant these roses. Yes. Love oh, I didn't say do have plants to defend. Oh, you do. Okay. So get your super potato. Get some really good deals there. Yeah, I would love to go to. Some... So you have to not only clear the weeds out, but also freshly till the land again. Man, being Good a farmer God. seems rough. My dad didn't do any of this. So that's probably why he wasn't a very good farmer. So I'm gonna plant four chilies here. Gonna fertilize these bad boys. I'm gonna water it. And there's stuff like upgrades to the watering can, so you can water multiple plants at once. Uh, I had one that was like, when you're watering a plant, it does a chain lightning effect and damages nearby enemies, oh, which cool. is really cool. Uh, so it seems like there's a breadth of, of upgrades and stuff, and with five planned early access roadmap dates, it seems like there is room for a lot. Speaking of dates, have they set like a release date? They have not. Okay. They said like, they used a really f fun plant metaphor. Okay. For like, you gotta see how it grows. Uh huh. Sorry, I get it. <laughs> um, I think. Oh. Fifteen dollars on sale right now for thirteen fifty on the Epic Games Store. Uh, no other platforms announced, but you gotta think this is coming to Switch. This seems like a Switch. Right. Switch. Um. So okay. Oh. God. Maybe maybe next. Well. I was gonna say maybe next wave I'll die and we can see what happens, but it really just calculates your score and gives you a number and then kicks you back to the effectively the main menu. Okay, let's get a little price report. Ooh, that looks delicious. Look at that chili. That. Yeah, it looks hot. My son came up with chicken and waffles all on his own today. <laughs> I made him waffles and he's like, Do we have any chicken? And I'm like, Of course we do. We got chicken fries, we got dining nuggies. It's like chicken fry. And he put it in there all by himself. He this this was his own discovery. I'm so proud of him. That's beautiful. You yeah. should have him like open a food truck or something. Yeah. Uh yeah. So I mean that's you've kind of seen what there is to see in Atomic Crops. Um, it's fun, you know. You, you got to know going in. You got to have room in your heart for another run-based game. I know there's a lot of those out. Um, especially this year, like Void Bastards was, oh, a, sure. was a game I was quite uh, fond of, even though it's slightly different. There's a uh, different vibe there. There's a different vibe there, and the, I, I just really, and I was charmed by this game. It, was, it wasn't until I got to this hub area and saw all these weird characters, like this guy, and right. I mean, this guy's whatever, but like... Remember the scummy guy that wants to sell you stuff? Yeah. Yeah, even he's growing on me. Yeah, ha! Ah, growing on you, like a crop would. Oh. What a place to end this on. Jason, thank you so much for oh, joining me. You, I'm glad man. we could get your first-hand farm experience. Yep. And uh, let's all tractor on out of here. Yeah.